Airport Safety Nets, innovative solutions in the CESAR collaborative framework. Since the beginning of aviation, safety has been the main concern of every air transportation stakeholder. Until the 1990s, airport operation safety was operated by air traffic controllers, helping the flight crew find their way. In 1995, the Advanced Surface Movement Guidance and Control System, based on ground radar surveillance, helped the tower controllers displaying the whole airport environment with all aircraft and airside vehicles superimposed on the airport map. From 2002 onwards, RMCA, a runway monitoring and conflict alerting function, was deployed at main airports to warn the air traffic controller when hazardous situations involving aircraft on a runway arise. Then came the CESAR program with outstanding results. CESAR has contributed to validate runway status lights and commissioned at Paris CDG Airport in 2016. This fully automatic system warns the flight crew with runway embedded red lighting in case the runway they are about to enter or take off from is already used by another aircraft or airside vehicle. Tower, this is flight 74 Lima 28 Charles. Alerts for vehicle drivers have been validated at Paris CDG Airport. This onboard system warns the driver if they are about to enter a restricted area, such as an active runway, or in case of a converging aircraft. In the short term, this system will be deployed at several European airports. CESAR also validated new safety nets for controllers to help them manage traffic when associated with an electronic environment like CMAC, conformance monitoring alerts for controllers and the detection of CATC, conflicting ATC clearances. These functions, highlighting potential hazards, are to be deployed at major airports covered by European regulation supporting the implementation of the European Air Traffic Management Master Plan. I'll copy. Over. Lastly, CMAC and CATC have been evaluated to accept many various inputs, such as airfield video cameras or ADSB data. This way, airports without extensive ground surveillance technology are also covered. Moreover, at major airports, the whole maneuvering area is now monitored. In the short term, based on the position broadcast by each aircraft, traffic alerts for pilots for airport operations will warn pilots directly in the cockpit in case of converging traffic on the runway area during takeoff and landing phases. Commercial and business airplanes can also be equipped with new onboard safety nets. In the same way, performance monitoring alerts for pilots explores an autonomous capability to raise a visual and audio alert for the flight crew in case the aircraft is deviating from a given air traffic controller clearance or airport procedure. Safety tools for avoiding runway excursions aim to compute, disseminate and integrate in the aircraft system a runway condition code characterizing the runway condition. Elaborated through various data sources, this code can then be used by airport operators to plan and maintain good runway conditions and by flight crew to plan and execute their landing phase. All those airport safety nets can operate simultaneously with and in addition to other safety nets to reduce the risk of accidents on the airport surface. The more safety nets we have, the more safety we get out of them. Nothing would have been possible without the CESAR partnership. And now, in CESAR 2020, the active cooperation of 30 European partners under DSNA's lead. 
airport operators, aircraft manufacturers, air and ground industries, research organizations, air navigation service providers and Eurocontrol. These large partnerships are necessary to innovate, standardize and rapidly deploy all the validated solutions.